Hey guys, I got so many email responses from my email list about iMovie. So this morning I uploaded a video on how to resize your video, repurpose your video for the all new amazing IGTV, which you don't want to miss out on. I have a video coming out about that pretty soon. But I wanted to make one on iMovie because it's a bit different from Final Cut Pro. It's, a, it's actually a bit more tricky in iMovie, but I've figured out an awesome hack for you guys. So here we go. You're going to create your project. You're going to hit Movie. And the first thing that you're going to do for your project is you are going to download this template that I'm going to put in the description box. So this template would allow you to measure your video so that you know exactly where your video is supposed to be. Right? So let me show you how this works. So I'm going to drop this onto my timeline. So you're going to go onto crop and make sure it says style fit, not crop to fill, not Ken Burns, but fit. That can happen sometimes. I'm not too sure why, but um, that's what's happening on my screen, right? So you're going to make sure it says fit. And what we're going to do is drop the video that we want to put over this. So we're going to add it basically as an overlay. And so I wanted to show you guys with this video, but I'm basically centered in this video. So it's going to come out right anyway, but this video, I'm not centered. So this is perfect. So I'm actually going to use this video and what you're going to do is you're going to see that we automatically got a new option here. So this is the overlay option because it's over a picture, right? So this is the picture that you're going to download and put in first, and then you're going to drop in your video as an overlay. Now what's going to happen is you're going to hit this option and you're going to make sure that you have selected picture in picture. Make sure that your cursor is somewhere that is over the image and the video at the same time. So now we see that the, the picture showed back up and what you're going to do is drag. You're not going to hold shift down. You're just going to drag with your mouse, right? You want to make sure, so you're going to cover up the picture, but you want to make sure that your, that you or the focus of your video is over this blue area, right? So I want to make sure that I am centered. If I do it like this, I'm going to be halfway on the phone's screen. So I want to make sure that I'm in the center and they can see me and then I'm going to keep making sure that I stay in the center. All right, so I'm going to keep making sure even if, you know, just go slowly and make sure that you are at the center of that blue strip and just keep going until you're sure that you are. So you can always check. I'm making sure that I am. And then I am going to, this is exactly what I want. Even if I have some room over there, that's fine because this is not going to show up on the screen. Only what's in that margin is going to show up on my screen in the IGTV, on IGTV. See, because I'm off center in this, I don't know if that's a word, <laughs> but because I'm off center in this video, I actually show up as half of a person instead of the full, uh, you know, full face or full frame, right? So I want to just make sure that this is fine. I'm centered in that frame that we created here. And then we hit export, right? So we're going to hit file. Um, we're going to hit IGTV. Um, you can name it, whatever. Make sure that you up, you change to better quality instead of faster and hit next. And guys, that's it. So I'm going to save this to my desktop and then I'm going to send it over to uh, my phone using AirDrop or you can email it to yourself. And when you upload to IGTV, it's going to be in that frame. I enjoyed sharing this with you guys. Let me know what if this was helpful to you. Make sure you download the template so that you're able to measure exactly what you need. And I'm excited, guys. I will connect with you guys pretty soon. Take care. Oh, be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe to this channel for more updates like these and for info on how you can create an amazing presence online to capture the audience that you really, really, really want to connect with through video and awesome visual content. I will see you guys soon. Take care.